Out Sun Prairie now, we energy spokesperson briefing the media. When anyone is doing construction work, they do need to call Diggers Hotline um, and follow those protocols. Um, so I would definitely check with Diggers Hotline to see if that um, did occur, but I don't have that information. For people who are just turning in to us, can you please just recap kind of what your, the situation is? Absolutely. So earlier this evening, We Energies was notified that a contractor struck one of our natural gas mains in Sun Prairie. And uh, as uh, the incident continued, we were also notified that an explosion did occur. We have been on site for quite a few hours now. Um, our first and foremost is to make sure everyone is safe and following the direction of the authorities. So we will continue to do that throughout the evening. Um, we were able to shut off the natural gas and we continue to check the area to see if there's any other issues that we need to resolve. And how many customers are affected by this? We have about 500 customers that are without natural gas at this time. And at this point, you have shut down everything that you believe needs to be shut down for everyone's safety. That is correct. Is there anything that you can tell us about what the next steps are going to be for you? We'll continue to follow the direction of the authorities as we go throughout the evening. Um, we um, will be part of the investigation to, to learn more. Um, but right now, I think the most important thing to know is that natural gas is no longer flowing. Um, and then again, that this incident did occur after a contractor did hit one of our natural gas lines. Do you know what time you actually got the gas turned off? Again, that's Amy uh, Jan, spokesperson for We Energies. The gas shut off in that area, but again, confirming that a natural gas line was struck in Sun Prairie about an hour prior to that explosion. And we'll be right back after this quick break.